Hey y'all, so uh, I'm here uh, and I want to show you how I make a 7 phase to begin with. Now the first step is, is always to record um, the WAV files and export the one from GarageBand. So uh, if I bring up some kind of a, a MIDI file, I can import it into a GarageBand and then export it <coughs> in a format that, you know, everything can read, so I usually do WAVE, because it's, well, exactly what the audio is, is what ends up in the file, so that's good. I don't want any compression messing with it, so I pick WAVE. Um, there's, there's another format that I could have used called AIFF, which is an Apple thing, I believe, but uh, some programs don't like it, and I can't remember if, if Preview, I mean, if um, Premiere does, but uh, I don't care. Wave works, and there's no reason not to use it for me, so I use Wave. And uh, so I export the GarageBand uh, one into Wave, the GarageBand phase, which is always the last one, so, well, I get them all ready, and of course, here's all the Eve Eternity 2 ones. Uh, I don't know what Eve Eternity 2... D oh, wait, that's those are the files that were... Okay, no, 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 I know what those are. Uh, well, I don't, and that's that's why they're not named the same as it's not the same naming scheme because I actually don't know what these were. These were just included in the wad, and uh, well, I'm not gonna post them until they until I know enough about them to give them a better name than that. But well, so I gave them temporary names here, which is what just what the the lumps were called in the in the the uh, MIDI file. Which, in fact, if I don't have the MIDI files on hand, I have to go and extract them from whatever wad I'm using. So that would be with a slate here. It's a program that allows me to pick out lumps or um, files within these wad archives, which are basically just zip archives. They're special zip archives, uh, especially for Doom. And um, I can extract files from them and even put files in and even modify the file in place inside the wad and then um, save uh, whatever. I can save the midis to a folder and then I can double click them and open them in the garage band to see how long they are and then I have to record each one all the way through six times and uh, because the last seventh one is just a garage band one so I just I can I'll do all those in like uh, an hour for one wad but the rest of the of the Phases all, are all done manually with Audacity. I have to use a loopback program called uh, Black Hole, which uh, I have an audio... It's basically an audio loopback uh, plugin for the MIDI setup in um, macOS. And why am I doing this on a Mac, you ask? Well, uh, it's actually... Like, if you did this on a PC... Well, you couldn't do this on a PC. I don't think this is well. It's I mean, it, you could, but it'd be worse. It would the audio would be sound more closed in, and uh, you wouldn't get that. You could wouldn't get the highest quality if you're doing it on Windows. So, I always do my audio stuff on a Mac, um, if I really care about it. That is, um, and if it's going up on the internet for people to actually use and listen to. So, um, if it's not just for me, I'm probably using a Mac to um, to deal with it. Uh, especially audio, because Windows has just horrific audio. But anyway, um, so yeah, I record them all on a Mac, and if it takes, uh, and if it's an eight-minute song, that means I have to sit here and watch the eight-minute song play out six times. If it's a forty-minute song, God forbid that did happen, and I or I just got that one right out of the way. It's up right now. It's a five-hour video. Um, and I, I actually did. I actually had. To, I actually used two Macs to record that one because eventually I realized I'm not going to be able to 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 finish this finish this by the end of the day. So as I was importing discs uh, in a, with a Mac Pro uh, at the time, actually multiple Mac Pros at the time, I had um, two Mac two MacBooks. One right on top of the other, uh, one on a chair, one uh, underneath the chair. They were plugged in and recording the 40-minute song. And I was just listening to it record because... Well, and, and actually after, I had to set a timer with my phone because my dad asked me if, he, if I wanted to watch a movie. I think it was a James Bond movie. The first James Bond movie I ever saw, which came out in 62. That's insane that something that old can look that good. But anyway... 
So yeah, it's a pain. If you if you have a 40 minute song, you have to let it play out 40 minutes, just like a, your tape camera. If you ever used one of those, it's the same concept, except I have to do it six times, and you only have to do it once. Uh, yeah, most other people would go into their audio editor and um, just export it. Like, it easy as that. Like, just like GarageBand. Um, the, the, the GarageBand um, phase is done that way, but the rest of them? Nope. I have to watch it play out six whole times for every single track. Which is why most of the Eternity 2 tracks aren't even done yet, let alone edited and uploaded. I'm not allowed to upload those yet anyway. Um, yeah, I, ma I, I made a deal with the, uh, the owners of... Um, or the leader of the Eve Eternity 2 project that I would upload them uh, six months um, after uh, after I had made the deal, which um, I'll maintain was the deal. It probably isn't now, but it was, and I'm sticking to it no matter what. Because uh, what am I going to do is not upload them. But anyway, um, so I have nuts done, but they're not edited and export, and, and the video isn't exported, and it's definitely not on YouTube yet. If we go to my channel, well, here's some crappy singing, which I got a bunch of views today. I don't I, Okay, interesting. Uh, but I'm out of videos to, that are scheduled, so I have to make more. I have to stop being a lazy ass. So, uh, well, uh, I posted this one <clears throat> but another one's being uploaded, which is nuts. I did the first uh, nuts um, song already. Um, of course, I don't own it. It was from the the nuts dot wad uh, file. But uh, since this is done, um, well, I have to close this project, or else it's gonna. If I op if I click new and then project, it'll open up a new project within this kind of. Window tab thing, which I actually hate the hell out of. I don't know why they did that. So, well, I have to go down to close project, which, because I'm on a cracked version of her Premiere, completely, uh, like, closes out any windows, which I don't, I don't think normally that it would do. So, now I can go to project, go to, or I can just type in nuts2. Well, that works. That's not how you spell nuts, but whatever. Hopefully, this isn't being overloaded. Like your mom was last night? No, okay, good. Um, I'm not recording with the built-in mic on my MacBook, because if I did, all you were to hear would be the fan, and I can't turn it down, because, well, let's see how much power this processor is uh, snapping up just recording. Uh, okay, not as much as I thought, but definitely not a cool 20-plus uh, watts at all times. So, yeah, CPU's... Uh, chugging along here, but anyway. <clears throat> so, we have our project here, and I like to switch this, uh, which it should already be, but for some reason isn't, to my templates um, list here, but uh, we'll deal with that in a second. I have to go into my files and go into my music and see if I can find the nuts2.wad and then import that, and then I have to go look for nuts2.wad garageband, uh, and import that as well. And I can minimize that, and now just select all in this in the in the project thing, and then we just drag it over here. And there's a why is there a why is there a dip there? Uh oh, what happened? I'm confused. Now nah, that's fine. That's supposed to happen. But anyway, uh, so yeah, our garage band, which is the smallest one, is at the end, and the rest are here. That looks like I half-assed it. What happened? That doesn't look right, because theoretically, if this were the entire song six times, it would be the GarageBand one times six. 
but since this is basically like three and a half of these, I probably didn't do the whole thing. Eh, whatever, it's probably copy and pasted anyway. I'm not gonna do it over. Um, so, yeah. And sometimes YouTube, YouTube will get a bug up his ass and decide to cut off the first uh, like half second or so of my video so the audio starts playing after it's actually started playing in the file that I upload so I have to make sure that this is that the start of the audio is a little bit uh, away from the actual start of the video uh, and that gives me time to fade in whatever I need to fade in here so that's gonna be the main title here which is structured as it is for a reason or for multiple reasons actually I'm not gonna go over those right now though so we need to change this to nuts uh, 2 dot wad and yes uh, I just just dragged a template over and that I'll be doing that a lot as well uh, it's gonna be uh, map a one nuts 2 I can't remember if this was a let there be nut uh, or not. I know it's not like the donkey plated goober edition one. That's the that's nuts three. So this must be the let there be nut one. But I'm not gonna put that in there. Um, sorry. Whoops! It didn't drag. Sometimes that doesn't drag. You have to drag it twice. Just really stupid. Uh, I would still love that to be a little bit further, but that's okay for now. And then I drag this, drag both of them to where they need to go. This one needs to go all the way to the end, and then I need to mess with the end a little bit. Yeah, GarageBand seems to have a way longer fizzle out. Uh, so yeah, so this one has to go as far as it needs to. Wait, what? Huh. Alright, so the Gus one is full. There we go. So we need to find the start of the next section here. They decreased how long the save takes between versions. I like that. I'm on the new correct one. <laughs> so now we need to go fluid synth, place that in. That's near perfect. Good enough though. That one's full as well. Okay. Hmm. Alright, so this next one is the ADL. I always do it in this order so I know which thing I need to put in next. So it's ADL, that'll go... Okay, now... I did do all of them correctly, so I don't know why... So this next one is... this one. I don't know why they, they added this, like, priority thing here. I just want them all in the same place. What the hell's wrong with you? Why'd they change that? And make sure they all start on the dime. Just like that. And now... Oh, no, that one's not done yet. You're here. This is Arachno next. Let's go to Browse. Sometimes it goes to Edit. That's just because I selected one of the text things. We go back to Browse and go to Arachno. Come on. Hey, I didn't tell you to put a fade. Stupid thing. 
It's done that twice now. Okay, so maybe... I don't know what's... I don't know why this is doubled. That's weird. Because these are all the same. Also, that's definitely peaking. I think that's a bug with Audacity, actually, because it doesn't actually sound like that when you're playing it in the game. So, I don't know what that's about. See on this. See, I see 55. Hey, why isn't snapping on? Oh, it must be. It's just longer. Okay, there we go. Okay, this is Garage Band. Hey, it's broken again. What the hell? I don't know what's up with that. But yeah, this is, uh. The Garage Band one is like twice as long as the rest. Okay, so that's broken again. So yeah, I don't know what's up with that, but anyway. Here's our finished product. We go to, uh... Or first you have to go to select everything with at A, or command A, and then, uh, command M to... Export a file, which would usually be uh, minimized, but not not in uh, not in Premiere. So sometimes this changes to GarageBand. I don't know why. I just rename it to whatever it would have been um, instead of that. And because uh, of how my because of how it's mixed, uh, I go to Apple ProRes because uh, I can be in the QuickTime format, which will let me export. In, un in an uncompressed audio format, which basically carries over my audio completely from the WAV files to the finished product. Although the, the GarageBand one can't go up to 32-bit or 32-bit float, it's always uh, 24 or 16-bit PCM. So, yeah. And because uh, I don't really care uh, what the video quality is, because this is literally just text with a black screen behind it. I can select the lowest, uh, ProRes codec here, or, like, uh, the lowest quality, and the, and the, um, qu and lowest quality, quickest to export, and quickest to upload, because it's the smallest. So, yeah. Then I, uh, change this to, uh, from whatever this is, I don't know what that is, to, uh, 100%, because, well, I don't need HDR graphics. Uh, although it's not selected, so I'm not sure what that would. I'm not sure what that's doing if I change it. But I'll, I always change it just to be sure. And I select use maximum render quality because why wouldn't I do that uh, in this situation? And uh, I go under advanced settings and click optimize stills because why wouldn't I do that? Makes the file smaller and it doesn't take that much longer. So, and I can export, and my uh, recording is probably going to lag a little bit here, but it doesn't take that long, especially given the uh, incomplexity here. And there it goes, and then I go to YouTube, go to Create, Upload Videos, and upload nuts two, and I do that however many times I need to. So we can close this project now. Open up a new one. Uh, nuts three. Go back to this. Go to nuts three dot wa or nuts three dot wave, uh, and then nuts three. 
Huh. Yeah, actually, so I have to do the title screen as well, so let's do nuts, nuts three, put those in, pop those in there, do my timing nonsense. I'm just going to do this rather quickly here. Uh, nuts three dot wad. I put one. Nuts three. And then go to browse. Gus. Uh, might I might get used to that actually. Okay, there we go. There we are. Let me go back here. There we go. It's fluid sense time. And yeah, this is definitely peaking. Nothing I can do about that, sadly. There we go. ADL. And and yeah, that's. That's a bug with Audacity, or a bug with ADL, or both. It just kind of doesn't do well when a lot of crap is going on. A lot of loud crap. Sounds really cool, though. At times. Oops. That did alright. There we are. Yeah, that is really freaking loud. Here we go, SC55. That's peaking as well. Again, nothing I can do about that. Oops. There we go. Garage band. And yeah, that's definitely broken still. Okay, there we go. There's nuts. Whoops. There you go. Let me export this in the same way as the other one. Whoops. Heard a stupid float, which is the format that I recorded in Audacity and uh, the files are exported with. Do that and then export. <coughs> and usually, as I do this, I'll go to archive.org. Go to uh, wait, what? I'm signed in, right? 
Oh, okay, good. Let's go here, then go to, uh... It's weird, okay. Demonize soundtracks files. Man, this laptop is just insanely overheated. How much power is this drawing? Uh, it's not as much as I thought. It's not overloading it, is it? No, okay. So we go here, then we go to... Uh, edit. Actually, I'm gonna start this upload real quick. You want to start uploads as fast as you can. Um, to save time. But... Yeah, this is being kind of slow, but that's alright. We'll press on. So, now we've done this one, we can close this project. Then do the Nest 3 title screen. So grab this, and then grab its three title screen. I'm not going to need that anymore. Alright. Do my timing thing. And go down to this. Bring that in. Nuts. Whoops. Nuts. 3. Dot wad. Um. Title screen. There's always something like this for the title screen. Title screen and then main menu, I guess. Then go to Gus, which is always the first one. It's definitely on the dime. And it, it actually cuts off abruptly. This is not a sudden error. go. Actually, I probably should bring this all the way over here already. Here we go. I don't know what's up with the freaking... Uh, piano. It doesn't... I don't know. Something with, um... How the guy put the music in the game. It's not right. Like, just how the MIDI files are. I think they're programmed differently than most... Do MIDI music. There we go. Back now, sound font. This 55 sound font. And then finally, GarageBand, of course.
But of course it's still broken, so... Do that. And that's done. Now I can export this. Oops. Oh, come on, Premier. Jesus. The incompetence in the UI design is... unmatched. Okay, I've seen worse, actually. Seriously, some app designers feel like they just... Like, they... They, they take it... They take it... They take a... Treating it as only a paycheck to the super degree. Or they're just really bad at UI design, one of the two. But the behavior of some UI design just puzzles the hell out of me of how that even happened. So, we'll quit Premiere Pro, we'll go to my page again, we'll go to upload this next this last video. And uh I'll probably... I might as well do those right now, but uh, first I'm going to start this upload. Which is going to take a long time. Come on. Come on, you asswipe. There we go. Select all these. Add. That's yeah, gonna take a while. I'll just leave that running overnight. But anyway, so now we gotta do these. I'm gonna reuse this. Um, nuts. Nuts. Wad. Soundtrack. Map O one. Uh. I'll just have that for now. We'll do... Nuts, Wads, Soundtracks. Nuts, Wads, Soundtrack. That sounds better. Alright. Let's go here. I don't know what I just removed, but I just removed something. Okay. Doom 2. I don't need to add an end screen. That's all right. Yeah, there we go. Schedule. Uh. That's two dot wad. Core date. Okay. Now we're gonna. Schedule just for uh, tomorrow. Yeah. <coughs> this mean that's three. That's three dot wad. Core date doesn't get carried over though, so that's weird. It's going to be March 2nd. <coughs> and this last one is going to be the title screen. Main menu. Right. It's going to be on the third. Here we go. And now that's uploading. These are scheduled, and uh, this one is public. And these are uploading as well, so that's all good. 
so that's not the entire process, but that's the, you know, after I record the stuff process. Um, apart from uh, adding the credit, which I'll do later. That's basically the process, so, yeah. This is going to be completely unedited. Uh, this is just a video after I've taken my sleep meds. I took them like an hour ago. Um, and I was just sitting in my bed, and I was like, you know, I have to edit. I still have to edit these videos, because I'm out of uh, videos to be uh, that, that are scheduled to come out. So I have to have some new ones to schedule, so I needed to make some anyway. So I decided to uh, show you how I do it. So yeah, thanks for watching, and say hello to my crappy mic. So, yeah. I'll see you all in the next 7 phase. Thanks for watching.